Why do we like the smell of gasoline? Have you ever found yourself pulling up at a gas station to fill up your car only to instantly roll down your window, lift your head up, close your eyes and just take a deep breath and inhale the delicious and beautiful smell of gasoline? Oh, no, oh, that's good. Because if you have, you're not alone and you're not weird at all. Plenty of people enjoy the smell and there's a perfectly good explanation for it. Let's dig deeper into understanding what makes some people fuel fiends. Chapter one, the science. Gasoline is composed of many ingredients, including de-icers, substances that melt or prevent the formation of ice, lubricants, anti-rust agents, and hundreds of chemical compounds known as hydrocarbons, such as butane, pentane, isopentane, and the so-called BTEX compounds like benzene, toluene, and xylene, why am I out of breath? But the one compound responsible for gasoline's gassy smell is benzene. Ho 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 benzene, you beautiful son of a Benzene is added to gasoline to improve engine performance and fuel efficiency. It has a naturally sweet smell which makes us particularly sensitive to it. It's so powerful that the human nose can detect it even if there's just one part per million in the air we breathe. That being said, we don't have a scientific explanation about why we actually like the smell of gasoline, but there are some theories out there. The reward center theory. The smell of gasoline activates your reward response center. When something triggers your reward center, the brain responds by releasing an increased amount of dopamine. Dopamine is the main neurotransmitter that plays a role in pleasure, motivation, and learning. Benzene, when inhaled, has a suppressing effect on the nervous system, resulting in temporary feelings of euphoria. Speaking of reward center, you might have missed our video about why you like feet, or some people like feet, the link in description below. When you get that hit of gasoline, your brain is basically telling you, oh, that's the spot right there, give me more. The memory theory. The smell of gasoline brings back memories. You know how sometimes you're sitting in a park minding your own business, someone passes by with a strong smell of perfume that makes you nostalgic and reminds you of your grandmother? That's because your nose can evoke powerful memories if it catches a familiar scent. This connection between scent and memory is called the Proust phenomenon. In the case of gasoline, your brain links the smell of benzene to a childhood memory, a road trip with your parents, playing in the street outside your house, painting walls at home with your mom and dad, and playing with your toys. You see, benzene was used in the manufacturing of toys, dolls and action figures specifically. You spend a lot of your time as a child playing with them, so you were exposed to benzene during playtime, and playtime was the best. Oh, Luigi, that's the spot. Chapter two, history. Here's a fun fact about benzene which makes it less weird for those of you who adore the smell. In the 1800s and early 1900s, the substance was added to aftershaves and douches to give the products an extra something something, as well as a sweet aroma that appeals to many. But this trend didn't really last for long, as it turns out benzene is a known carcinogen and is dangerous when inhaled in high concentrations. Chapter three, health. According to the CDC, benzene causes cells to malfunction. For example, it can cause bone marrow not to produce enough red blood cells, which can lead to anemia. It can also damage the immune system by changing the levels of antibodies and blood, resulting in the loss of white blood cells. Inhaling it can affect all our organs, and most commonly the lungs, causing a severe type of inflammation called hydrocarbon pneumonitis. By the looks of it, benzene is pretty dangerous. However, the seriousness of it poisoning you you, all comes down to the amount, route, and length of time of exposure, as well as your age and any pre-existing medical conditions you might have. Chapter four, the conclusion. Bottom line is, some of us like the smell of gasoline. It's not a weird thing, in fact, it's pretty common. We like it because it triggers our reward center. We like it because it reminds us of our childhood. There's tons of scientific research about why we like the scent of gasoline, and scientists want to get to the bottom of the phenomenon. Should we be concerned? Well, according to a study on PubMed, almost 10% of the total population has been identified as gasoline inhalation abuse. Users. That's a problem. And ridiculous TikTok trends only add to that abuse. So be mindful that sniffing gasoline can turn habitual and dangerous. 
Thank you so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, make sure you smash that like button. And if there's any other video you'd like us to make, let us know in the comments below. Subscribe to the channel. And if you want to know why we like feet, check out the video in the description below.